Are you making an effort to eat clean, like reducing processed foods, chemicals, damaging seed oils, going BPA free, getting rid of plastics, eating all organic, all those great things. Well, you can eat clean until you're blue in the face and it won't resolve your unexplained health issues until you clean up the neurotoxins that are already in your body. Drop me a comment below and I'll DM you a direct link to the neurotoxicity assessment quiz. In this very short quiz, you'll know if you're suffering from neurotoxicity. Who am I? I'm Donna, I'm a wellness coach. I am my own case study with detoxing. And I was so thrilled about my health improvements that I decided I had to make it my mission to share my results and what I did to get them with as many others as possible. Eating clean will prevent further neurotoxicity in your body, which is good, but it won't clear up those chronic health issues until you get rid of the neurotoxins that are already in your cells causing cellular inflammation. These neurotoxins are there and likely have been there for decades because once they get into your cells, in the fat cells especially, then it's very difficult to get them out and you need special binders and herbs that will take them out of the cells. Some of you already had these toxins in your body as a baby because they are passed in utero from the mother. There's been many studies done on that. So if you have unexplained health issues like cortisol, hair loss, weight gain around the belly, especially that you can't seem to get rid of it, depression, anxiety, um, insomnia, there's so many, then no matter what you do, you're not gonna be able to clear these up until you get rid of the neurotoxins already in your body. So drop me a comment below. I'll DM you a direct link to this neurotoxicity assessment quiz. It just takes a couple of minutes and you're gonna know if this might be something you're suffering from is neurotoxicity.